What really gets me excited is developing a new product for the growers. I had an opportunity to grow up on a farm and I like to make that connection between a, the scientists creating a new product and getting back to the farm. I've been here with BASF for six years. I love what I do. Every region's a little different, so we have to focus regionally on, on what to do, but we've got two discovery breeders. They develop markers that are connected to the DNA from the field, lab, and then to the farmer. We have to test everything that we have on the farmer's field, and we use that data to make selections. The key to staying ahead of what the farmers really need, innovation. What does that innovation look like? It's a holistic view. We start at the very beginning, make crosses between elite parents, but we also want to release something that the farmer's going to like. Yield potential is the key. And in cotton, fiber quality as well. Those, those parameters go hand in hand. That's what brings a grower or a farmer a profit. In BASF, we utilize the knowledge of everybody we have on the team, and we combine that to get a product for the farmer. And as we test it, we then narrow it down to a couple varieties that then the agronomic services could then start to look at these products that could possibly go commercial. The agronomic services group is a very diverse group. With BASF, the agronomic services role is to take the experimental varieties, take them out to the field, and we incorporate them in our agronomic performance trials. Those trials are farm trials that go across the cotton belt. We have growers that are growing in West Texas with very limited water, and then you have growers all the way in Georgia, of course, that are operating with heavy rainfall, and we're able to take those environments coupled with the growers' management styles. We're able to see how these new varieties are best going to fit on a given grower's operation. We're able to, to go from the trait development group, from the breeding group, and then take that information to the farmer's doorstep. I farm in Dawson County, which is in the western part of Texas on the South Plains. I'm a fourth generation cotton farmer. Our business is called Broadview Agriculture. We named our business because where we farm is, has a very broad view. It's one of the main economic driving forces here in West Texas. Not only do you have the farmers, but you have all the, the supply chain that is involved in, in the production. When we buy a bag of cotton seed, and with the price that we're paying, we need to make sure it's a variety that we can depend upon to do what we need it to do. Well, we've been growing FiberMax and Stoneville varieties for many years. The reason why we always go back to those varieties is because they're consistent. They seem to do very well here on the South Plains of Texas. I know that when I plant that seed, it's going to come up strong and it's going to yield what we need to stay profitable in the business that we're in. You know, the people that have worked there with FireMax and Stoneville, I've known for many years. They've always been very knowledgeable, very willing to help, always seem to have the farmer's best interest in mind. And so, to me, that's been probably the greatest thing that they've offered. It's really important for us to have the voice of the grower and help us guide the things that we do every day. We started a cotton advisory council and we've invited growers across the cotton belt to come together and meet and share what's happening on their farms. We're seeing innovation come throughout our entire line. One of the innovations that BASF is really proud of is our E3 Sustainable Cotton Program. It gives us the ability to connect what's happening on the farm with that grower and how they're producing that crop sustainably. All of us at BASF are extremely excited to have a new herbicide trait that we will launch in 2023. The identifier is GLIXTP. and It'll have the two herbicide traits that you're familiar with. We'll also bring in the ExtendFlex trait. It allows the cotton to be sprayed with a HPPD chemistry. And then it'll have the three gene worm trait of the TwinLink Plus. Growing up on a farm in South Georgia and being able to connect with growers across the cotton belt and the innovation that farmers need is a really great place to be at now in my career and helping BASF achieve the goals that we have of being market leader.